Okay, in this particular playlist, we're going to be dealing with certs. And the question we've been given is root x times root 18 divided by root 3 equals that. What's the value of x? Okay, well, the easiest way of dealing with these is that when you see a denominator, it's better to multiply through by that denominator and then I lose this side. So if I multiply both sides by root 3, what I end up with is losing this side altogether. So on the left hand side of the equation, I end up with root x times root 18, and that's going to equal 8 times root 3 times root 3 again. Okay, so that gives me the opportunity then to solve this and get a whole number from it because root 3 times root 3 is root 9. So what I've got here is 8 times root 9. Well, the root of 9 is 3. So 8 times 3 is going to give me 24 on this side. If you're not too sure about that, maybe have a look at some of the other thirds questions and that will give you some idea of how to work the right hand side. On the left hand side here I've got basically root x times root 18. Well it's just as easy for me to write root 18x. So I've got this situation where root 18x equals 24. All right well the best way of dealing with that now is to get rid of this root sign. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to square both sides of the equation because if I square a square root I end up with a value of 18x I just kind of lose that square sign on the right hand side I end up with 24 squared if you pop that into a calculator 24 squared is going to give you 576 so 576 okay so 18x equals 576 if you divide through then by 18 OK, it will give me um, x equals 576 divided by 18. That's going to give me a value of 32. And that's the answer to my question. So what we've done here is gone from some fairly sophisticated presentation of thirds. We've broken it down, got rid of the denominator first, and then got rid of the square root sign. And then from there, it's just a case of dealing with relatively straightforward algebra, I hope. Um, but it does take a little bit of practice is to work through these things. Please do add a comment below. I'll always come back to you. I look forward to seeing you inside the next video.